No matter where you go, you will be surrounded by living things that you cannot see. You can go in your yard, you can go in the ocean, you can even go in a hole in the ground, and trillions of living things will be all around you. They are microbes. What's up everyone, Super Auto Gaming here, and today we are going to be using a little bit of microbe. So, honestly, we haven't seen a lot of microbe in a while, but it is still incredibly strong. Being able to uh, destroy equipment with weakness, especially giving it to the entire team, is incredibly powerful. Uh, I don't know if you've seen, but uh, a couple of builds I've gone against, they have like a hedgehog, toad, blowfish, and after the hedge hedgehog goes off, then it gives the entire enemy team weakness. That's incredibly powerful. So it's very similar to that, except I only need uh, one microbe. You don't even need it at level two. You don't need anything like that. Just the one. Uh, pair it with some summon... Uh, units, which is what we're going to do, have Eagle and um, probably a bit of Vulture. Vulture works really well because, uh, of course, they're going to take more damage because they're weakened. Um, and we're going to start off with a classic Emperor Tamarin. So, you know, I love my Emperor Tamarin. This way we can build him up very big and transfer him off onto a, uh, you know, a Tier 5 or a Tier 6. It always works out really, really well for me. I don't know. People say it doesn't work out for them. I don't know if they're doing it wrong or what. All you got to do is put like some stats into it every once in a while. Get it to at least level two. I mean, and then you can just start popping off. You trade that onto something good. And I mean, you're like Bob's your uncle. Like what else more do you need? Like, I don't understand. I, I just don't understand. Okay. Well, we're going to move past that though. Um... Also, if you hear like some some big booms in the background, that's definitely like I live in a good neighborhood. OK, it's not it's not anything like that. It's, you know, around Fourth of July, a bunch of people shooting off fireworks. I don't know why they're shooting off fireworks, though. Um, I don't really think it's that joyous of a time, but, you know, whatever floats their boat, I guess. Um, speaking of that, I guess for a second, I am going to say that, you know, some people say that. I remind them of Technoblade, and unfortunately, Technoblade actually passed away um, the other day from cancer, and it was, you know, it just made my day go from okay to absolutely horrible, because I love Technoblade. I've been watching his stuff for a very long time now, a few years, and he's always been super joyous, um, super funny absolutely amazing like just an inspiration to so many people and you know this fourth of july it just don't it don't really feel like the move you know but despite that we keep moving forward and you know we just we got to keep going um do what he would want you know keep laughing keep having fun uh keep spreading like positive vibes um so enough of that. Uh, enough of that, though. I'm I'm getting. I feel like I'm getting a little sentimental here. I'm getting upset. So let's let's get into this game. Um, as you can see, we move the tamarind stats onto the eagle, and you know it's already absolutely massive. And then, of course, we have the level two hatching chick. I have been really into hatching chick lately. Not like that. God Jesus. Um, I have really been looking for buying more hatching chicks just the the way that it scales and levels up has been very very helpful especially once you get it to level three getting uh, that experience is absolutely nutty but here we're gonna level up the eagle i was really hoping for a tiger or um you know white tiger is always good anything like that oh by the way this is actually not my greed pack this is a specific microbe pack so if you saw the build there in the the beginning then you can copy this and try to go for some microbe strategies. And it's still incredibly strong. We don't have microbe yet. As you can see, we haven't found them, but uh, we're searching. For sure, for sure searching for this man. Oh my God, dude. Tongue twister. I can barely speak as it is, okay? Um, but yeah, we got the tiger in here now, which will be very, very good for our eagle. I absolutely love 
the Eagle loot box, just getting as many things out of it as possible. It's always super fun, super exciting. So, uh, and we're doing very well here. Now we could actually get a level three hatching chick and I had mentioned it before and you know, I gotta do it. Now we can actually get a level two tiger pretty soon. Uh, we're not gonna freeze the vulture yet because I'd much rather find uh, the microbe. I, that's what I need for the team to, to really pop off. Um, and microbe is just amazing to, to get rid of all of the equipment on the enemy team. And uh, this way we don't have to have any on our team. We can have stuff like grapes, actually, which is uh, very helpful. So we actually get the gold on our turn. And when the uh, when weakness gets rid of it, you know, doesn't matter. We don't we don't mind too much. So that's why it's that's why I have grapes. I normally don't run grapes at all, but I knew in a microbe team it would actually work out pretty well. So we finally find the microbe here. It took long enough. I think about getting the Octo because it could do very well on the team. Microbe and Octo, of course, you deal a lot of damage and the damage is amplified by weakness. So yeah, see having Microbe here would have been really, really good. Uh, we don't get it. However, we do get some major guys out of our uh, Eagle and just enough to barely win there. Wow. We would have dominated, though, if we had Microbe, and it didn't matter. We also had a life to spare, so I was totally fine with that. <laughs> yeah, buy, sell this uh, Zebra. Gotta have it. Still deciding whether or not I want to get the Octo in, but I think it would be much better to find, say, a Turkey. Oh, Spino would have been amazing to get in here. Uh, all I instead do is look at him for a while. Okay, no, we do get our man in here because uh, Spino is good for this team for sure. Um, but I would still like to find a vulture. Honestly, sometimes I forget that Spino is slightly better than Turkey. You know, just, uh, it just really depends on the team. Oh, this was amazing here. If only, uh, it would have been swapped. I would have had, uh, I would have gotten a lot of guys out of my saber tooth, but that's fine. That's fine. And actually here, one great thing about running a microbe team is that you have the ability to throw. So I wanted to get a level 3 eagle and a level 3 tiger, and sometimes you just can't do it. However, if you are able to, I would say go for it. You know me, I'm super greedy, so that's what we got to do. Here, I was like, okay, we can get my boy Turkey in here. Probably should have got Vulture in because now we just find the other Vulture, which means we could have instantly got a level two, but I don't mind that much. We have to make sure that Turkey still gets buffed, and I put Eagle at the back because this is the most likely way for me to actually throw. We go against the same guy, and thank goodness he was really strong because uh, who knows, I, I could have beat him somehow, somehow, some way. And here we are finally going to get the full setup have the level 3 Tiger, have the level 3 Eagle, and there ain't nothing that can stop us now. Turn 14 is a bit late, but with all of this, come on, dude, come on. And if we could have made it to next turn, we could have even got a level 2 Vulture. Now, I should have kept the Vulture in the back, too. For some reason, I switched the Turkey. I would have just gotten ruined by a, a Crocodile player. So I'm glad I didn't do that, or I'm glad I didn't get uh, destroyed. But anyways, as you can see, we go against another summon team, but, you know, I've got some big boys. Uh, anyways, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Like and subscribe if you did. And you know what? Have a fantastic day.